Hello, I'm back again with another technique or a tool, how do we use uh, ChatGPT. So uh, very recently we found that there are GPTs within ChatGPT, which are totally, totally focused on uh, learning and development, training, mentoring, coaching. Uh, so what I did is quickly did a screen record on uh, finding out GPTs within ChatGPT about learning and development and under that I picked up e-learning for the first GPT which is created by somebody about thousand plus people are following it and using it so let's jump right in and let's see what we have in store great guys so today we will learn a little bit more about chat GPT uh, not the paid version the free version so chat GPT open AI we'll go here we will open the page and this is where it takes us this is my login uh, now uh, watch carefully I am only focusing on learning and development so I will go into my profile and I will say uh, my GPTs and under my GPTs then it will take me here then I will open learning and development you will hit enter it will take some time as you see it's working on it and it will only give you uh, GPTs which are related to learning and development see under chat GPT free version there are so many GPTs that are only and only focused on learning and development you can pick any of these today for an example uh, I will just pick up this first one which is e-learning expert instructional designer there are about 1000 plus people follow this and are currently using it but you can pick up any of these and try your hand on it let's pick up this one it will let's start the chat now it will come here if you see e-learning expert instructional designer so this is what I have what I will do is I will brainstorm with this GPT to even give me prompts that I can use uh, to better leverage chat GPT okay so let's do this uh, hi please help me with prompts that I can use to leverage chat GPT help me create better e-learning programs and hit enter and let's see what it says okay this is fantastic these prompts are organized around the eddy framework with additional examples for specific instructional needs so it's giving me all this can you help me define the learning objective of a course a design phase can you suggest a course outline development phase implementation phase so it will cover the whole eddy model basically for us let's wait while it's still working on it uh, and plus it's giving me some additional questions that we can use uh, even for gamification so for example specialized e-learning elements what are some gamification techniques to make a course whatever your topic for more engaging micro learning scenario based learning this is beautiful this is beautiful but what i don't see here is the technical aspect so let's let's ask uh, gpt again uh, this is great can you please add a technical section prompts as well to the above list yes. 
okay great awesome so technical section from lms integration and technical capability uh that's one multimedia optimization what are some guidelines for compressing optimizing video files accessibility and compliance standards what are the key consideration for ensuring my e learning course meets ada the compliance part of it data tracking and reporting troubleshooting so these are this is the way that you can brainstorm with chat gpt uh, to even find out the right prompts that you can use to get to the right answers so this is just an example i thought i will give you more insights on what we are doing uh, at my company leveraging uh, gpts specifically focused on learning and development so this is how you design that uh, so i will stop this video now but i will have you guys try your hands on it thank you so much okay so that was it uh, i hope uh, you will find it useful uh, i am finding it very very useful obviously i am i'm super thrilled with uh, these uh, gen ai uh, different platform the gemini chat gpt uh, or now notebook lm so i keep experimenting i'm i'm asking my team to get themselves trained on these things and these tools are really really helping us so hey with this i will thank you for your time and maybe in couple of another days i will get you another technique on how better we can use chat gpt so till then thank you bye